So thanks to Reddit, I have a tangible idea for a video, one that I feel is interesting to get into and explore, so here it is. But this is a screenshot that I've had in my phone for quite some time now, and I always figured the stuff that's discussed within this thread was something to talk about on the channel. And so feel free to have your insights or feedback on the matter. So the one thing I want to get into, the one thing that really stuck out to me is how someone had mentioned in an article, according to this person, that Donald's career is basically him running away from the praise he gets anytime he succeeds at anything. So when I first initially read that for the first time, I was like, that's one way of looking at it. That is definitely one way at seeing how he's just maneuvered himself through Hollywood in the presence he's made for himself. However, I wouldn't use the terminology running away, but I do essentially understand where the person's coming from. I feel like where this is the most relevant is when he had left community. It's like, he was this beloved character. Everyone loved Troy. Everyone loved how the energy he brought to the show. Um, and he really brought the character to life, you know, despite Dan Harmon having other creative ideas prior to casting Donald. It's just like when he left, people were like, oh, he's leaving to be a musician. He's leaving to be an, a rapper when in actuality it was just to do other things with his life. I didn't want to do community anymore. I asked. To, to leave because my heart really wasn't in it and they they thankfully just were like yeah and they let me go I just don't want to have a job anymore I don't wanna have a boss I don't want to do that anymore like I, I feel like you know if I, if I stayed there I'd be doing uh, my life a disservice not because that show is bad that show the community is like I think one of the best shows on television um, but it's not mine I want to I want to not have my own show per se but I just want to make dope dope shit from now on. I would assume as a fan that he just felt inclined to pursue it regardless of the risk and the sacrifice at hand. Yes, leaving community, if things didn't go as planned, then you know he would have faded in obscurity. And look at how things turned out. It turned out for the better. He's made a name for himself outside of that show. And this is just my take. I feel as though had he stayed and listened, I feel as though he would have had that or gradual fear of being typecasted as this happy-go-lucky character. Yes, he did go on to like do other type of comedic roles, but it's like that's not what he's known for. Despite that, you know, despite the today, right? He he's still associated with the role of Troy, but again, that's just because he was just this beloved character. Uh, there really isn't much to say on that. Yeah, that's really it. I think the same logic how he runs away from praise is really difficult to really apply that to other mediums such as acting because shows have to stop being made right they can't just go on forever it isn't an anime where it's weekly uh it's like they have to stop the production go back to writing the seasons and then come back then post-production retakes reshoots all this other stuff and it's like it's really hard to really apply that same knowledge or that same logic rather uh to this whole running away thing with music again i think it's the same deal a lot of this stuff is not made overnight so within that time or amidst that time he can just do other things while everything is happening and brewing in the background but yeah there really isn't much to say other than him wanting to do other things like no one with as many aspirations as him is going to stick to one thing and just call it a day i i wouldn't expect that out of any renaissance man anyways the second thing i want to get into is how donald disappoints the fans that he makes in the way that this person is coming across my interpretation was like imagine going from because the internet to awaken my love you're going into aml for like raps one-liner flows and instead you get psychedelics get this old funk soul type of sound and you're like this is not for me this is not something i'm accustomed to and to each their own right you're not gonna like everything that your favorite artist puts out you know you're gonna have a desired taste and sound and what you like listening to um but i feel as though a part of me does feel that a lot of the disappointment is coming from people who are new fans because I can't imagine someone who's been there since like Sick Boy or even Camp to now and is like, oh, I don't like this. And But I don't know, maybe I'm a bit ignorant towards that idea because even me, someone listened to just about everything that this man has done. Uh, there's some things I don't like about what he's done in terms like music and other creative works. It's just, it's just not my thing. And so I feel as though it's really just a conversation of preference and there's nothing wrong with that. And the last thing I want to talk about is Donald being performative and it's like he's having a massive identity crisis. Performative, who's to say? An identity crisis? 
perhaps maybe a psych evaluation will reveal that he's not a renaissance man after all just someone going through an identity crisis i thought it was pretty funny but i don't know i never got the impression any of it was performative but just someone who has a lot of goals and just so happens to have the ability to complete them with a lot of success it's like performative i don't know we don't know how he really thinks we're just fans we're not in his head um the whole identity crisis thing though i don't know it's like watching any other person grow that's that's kind of just how life is you're gonna go through many transitions through your life like because the internet for example he's witnessed a lot of death in his life and death is takes a toll on people like you're not gonna be the same person you were the day after witnessing that um it's just kind of the way it is and even outside of that like before he he was growing up <laughs> i don't think there's much to say about that like you're not going to be the same person you were a decade ago um and so on and so forth that's kind of just how it works it's like the season's changing you you get what i mean but that's pretty much all i want to get into this video how do you feel in regards to this comment thread that i found on reddit and yeah i would love to see and hear feedback on it anyways that's it that is all um see you next time whenever that is and thank you for the channel reaching 5,000 subscribers i really appreciate that